Houston's not an obvious city. There isn't a main street. You have to take the time to discover it village by village, and it's, it's worth the time. Me and my son David run the kitchens at Churrasco's restaurant. Churrasco's is really the best representation of our Nicaraguan heritage and our traditions. We tell our guests, you're going farther south than you've ever been for dinner. The food is seemingly exotic, but surprisingly approachable. This dish is a lobster campechana, Mexican style ceviche, which is tomato based. And what makes it unique, it's paired with pork crackling. So you get the crunch and the tanginess of the tomato. It's a very harmonious dish. Churrasco's is located in the new epicenter of Houston. That's where the immigrant population is. That's where the energy of Houston lies. There is endless ethnic inspiration. You can travel the world in a day. A great neighborhood is Long Point. There's a small but vibrant Korean population there. I visit those markets to get ingredients for the restaurants. My favorite is Korean fried chicken. It's fried twice, so it has this incredible crunch. There's a lot of greenery, and that's because of the expansiveness of the city. I love walking down along the Buffalo Bayou Park. There's amazing trails for running, for biking. You can even kayak on the bayou. That's where I am on my time off. It's where the city comes together. The first word out of the moon was Houston. The eagle has landed. Today, it still is an important part of our history. Next to NASA, you have the Kima Boardwalk, a combination of restaurants and amusement park and a great family place to watch the sunset and eat some fresh seafood. Houston's awesome. <laughs>